um, right now I'm here in Topanga. This the road just opened. For those who know, we had a mudslide, and Topanga Canyon Boulevard's been closed for months, which I loved because I live right on that boulevard. And aside from the road, it's just really country out there. Um, oh. I have goats and quail, and my kitty and my doggy, and a lot of fruit trees and. I'm a permaculture designer now, so that's what I'm up to pretty much. I, I really feel that there are two distinct camps inside fashion and that one is a camp that's full of love and joy um, for life and people and it's inclusive. And it that side of fashion wants to dress everyone in a fabulous way so that life is more beautiful. And then there's the other side of fashion that is about exclusivity. And it is all about saying, I'm in the popular club. You can tell because I've got this logo or this bling or whatever, this I'm Ozempic skinny, you know, it, and that is a side of fashion that I just can't stand. And I have never had any tolerance for it. We're, we're sort of made to believe or given the idea about like, you can't, do this if you want to be that and you can't look like this if you're gonna all that stuff we we just realize it's in flux right as we get older all of the conventions have changed since we were kids so whatever anybody tells you while it could be true it's not going to stay true and you as much as anyone have a chance to make it to make space for yourself I mean you more than anyone you are the only one who has a chance to make space for yourself really I'd have dreams of opening the door at the dog house and there being a garden or, you know, the beach outside or something. So I knew I didn't want to stay in that urban environment, even though living in an art village inside of an urban environment was definitely the best that that was going to be. I'm a firm believer in the matriarchy, which isn't where women take the leadership roles of the patriarchy. The matriarchy is where instead of the highest good being the king of the mountain, the highest good is life and the makers of life. And we do everything to support life and the makers of life. That's the matriarchy. And so honoring my mom and honoring my role as a mom has been so very, very important to me.